First, we're working new details on a police brutality investigation. The man who says a Providence police officer beat him into a coma is still behind bars, even though a federal immigration judge ordered him released nearly two days ago. Eyewitness News reporter Alex Prada spoke with Louis Mendonca's family today. He joins us now live with the Mobile Newsroom. Well, Aaron, Louis Mendonca was brought to court in Attleboro today to answer a warrants charge even though no judges are in court today. They're all in a court conference. That will mean he will spend another night behind bars and his attorney calls this newest development fishy. The family of Louis Mendonca gathered at Attleboro District Court hoping to bring home the 21-year-old. But after more than four hours, they were told he wouldn't be free today. I just want him home. That's what we want. We want him home because it's already been nine months, eight months. We can't take this no more. Mendonca was brought to the court to appear before a judge to clear up a warrant for not appearing to answer a shoplifting and assault charge last year. But because the judges are in a conference today, his case wasn't heard. They need to let him go. That's all I want. I want my brother home. At the time the warrant was issued, Mendonca, a Cape Verdean native, was locked up on federal immigration charges. A judge tossed the charge on Tuesday, allowing him to stay in the United States. They purposely held him out Tuesday. They purposely held him out uh, yesterday because they knew today there was uh, no judges available. Mendonca has been jailed since October on simple assault charges after a scuffle with RISD security and Providence Police. The arrest was caught on surveillance video. Providence Police Detective Robert DiCarlo has been charged with assault for striking Mendonca with a flashlight after he was put in handcuffs. Mendonca was left in a two-day coma and served 90 days at the ACI for the crime. To me, everything looks fishy, everything looks suspicious. Why are they dragging it? Why is it taking too long? He's already, if whatever he's done, he's already paid the price. Mendonca's attorney has filed an appeal asking a magistrate to hear this case because the judges are unavailable until Monday while they're in that court conference. And we're live with the Mobile Newsroom tonight. I'm Alex DiPrato, Eyewitness News.